name is Shannon Black. I own Sunrise Montessori, and we offer um, academics and loving care for children from infancy through five years old. Plus, we also have after-school pickup and summer camps for elementary children. At the time, I was teaching math, and um, my son was about one and a half, and I kept looking for a Montessori school. My sister um, had told me that that's the way to go. I was doing tour after tour, and I just wasn't impressed. They either smelled or seemed really unkept, dirty, um, or not very welcoming. I used to be a teacher. I could sniff burnout really easily, and the teachers seemed very burnout with their interactions and tone with the children. And I kept looking and looking and couldn't find anything. And so I started to develop a list of what I wanted. And then um, my husband, Rob, teasingly said, well, maybe you should just open one since I was being so demanding and critical. And that's what planted the seed. I just kept researching. And then I finally found the right property um, to open a four classroom school. And so I looked at Rob and said, are we doing this? And he's like, yeah, you can absolutely do this. And he was great at construction, so he could help me um, turn this, what had been a house, into a school. And um, basically from the beginning, I just tried to make sure that, basically that every thought that I had, every intention, I was trying to create the best place as a parent, um, because that was my number one goal, was that I wanted a place where I felt my child was safe, was loved and was learning. And if those were not happening, then that was not the right place. So the goal is as they come in, it's inviting, it's warm, the teachers are happy, they're communicative, and by extension, so are the children. The children are doing well, and if we've done our job right, they're leaving to move on to elementary school, already knowing how to read, and uh, add and subtract four-digit numbers, which I think is pretty rad. So. 15 years later, I feel really good about what I did. Obviously, I was able to make it work through all the ups and downs of the recession and COVID, but um, but I, I definitely feel like it's something that I um, was meant to do just because of the impact. So, and my son is now a senior in high school and is doing well, and so it felt like that was the right spot, the right move for all of us. Back when Google was just starting, um, budgets and ads. I was creating the ads. This is all before they would give suggestions and all that. This is like, you know, over 10 years ago. Well, it was starting to become a lot more complex. I felt like I was missing something, that I was a novice that was starting to basically be edged out because I didn't understand. I, I knew that it could be better and I didn't know how to do it. And I didn't have time to learn what I needed to become now a tech expert. There's just, it's like, there's too many things. So I was at um, a, a business group and Jessica was there and, um, and she and I got to talking about um, hot dog marketing and what she did. And I thought, huh, maybe I'll use that one day. But it didn't occur to me at that moment because I didn't think I was big enough at the time. I didn't think that it was something I could afford. I thought it was for bigger businesses. Fast forward um, about a year. I was looking at starting another school and I realized, okay, I can't keep doing this. I need something way more than what I'm doing. So I started looking in to different companies and landed on Hot Dog because of different things. So one, it was affordable. That was a huge surprise to me. I had no idea that it could be so affordable that they will completely tailor it. And over the years, as I've needed more, like with the opening and gearing up of that, of my second location, and then pulling back after we were open, and the needs changing. It started off with just, you know, we need families to know that we're in this new location, and then, okay, now they know that. Now it's changing to this other of, um, oh, we need more enrollment in this one age group. And then during COVID, it became um, advertising and touching on more about what we're doing with sanitation, what we're doing with safety that's different um, to help parents know that, you know, they're sanitation procedures we're following and whatnot. I basically have just kept in communication with Jessica and asked um, her um, questions along the way, like, hey, this is what we're experiencing. Do you have something that can help with that? And by slowly entrusting my needs with hot dog marketing, over time, they basically come to me and said, okay, if you do this and this, this would make a difference. Um, and I've tried some, and generally speaking, it's all been like, 
been absolutely fantastic. The suggestions that Hot Dog has offered me over the years has just been so incredibly intuitive in ways that were completely unexpected that I really cannot imagine using another agency because I don't feel like a number. I don't feel like I'm just one more person that they're trying to suggest things to to get more money. I feel like that they're actually looking at my business uniquely and holistically and trying to figure out what works for this business. Let us give you some suggestions. And again, not all of them are about what they can do for me. It's like, hey, we noticed this. You know, if you want to try this the next time you blog or if the next time um, you load a picture, if you wanted to consider loading a picture like this, because that's what we're seeing in the background back here in our office that people are searching for online. That kind of intel is priceless. Like, I, there's no way I would ever know that. So the fact that they're helping me um, so well just feels like a blessing.